Hello guys, this is Sony Free. I'm back. I managed to go back into my YouTube channel. Lucky day for me. But I haven't sorted the PlayStation 4 out just yet. But I will be. I hope, don't know when, but it will be soon. I am hoping then soon later. I'm not mentioning who's. I hoping this person drop or gave me one this. Is Wi-Fi to me? I can actually can use to do my, finally do my recordings, and I would like to thank my mate who ordered me Fever Twenty One. And when I get the lift to her, I'm gonna find out he actually got the game just yet because he ordered his own. If he has got it, hopefully sometime soon. I don't know when. Probably this week. On next week, I will be doing my Fever 21 career mode. You heard me at Manchester United. And what I'm going to do is this. I'm going to put a poll in for each player I want to bring in. In the description below of, of this video. And I want you guys to vote. It's going to be on YouTube, I don't know how to do it on... Most I don't know how to do it on YouTube, but I know how to do it on Twitter. It's a lot easier. First thing, goalkeepers. I will keep David and Dean Henderson, because I'm planning to use David for the Premier League matches, Dean Cup matches, but I want one more goalkeeper. And I want you guys... Fault. The goalkeepers I'm planning to bring in is I'm not what you guys to fault is even Jordan Pickford Nicholas Pop or Changey Donorama Those three goalkeepers and White backs you guys could put in a comment below which white back I should bring in to be a perfect replacement for Iron One Biasca if he gets injured, or I could use that white back for the like cup games, mostly cup games or easy teams in the league or whatever. Left back, that's fine. I'm happy with the right left back because we just signed Alex Tyrus this season. We got Luke Shaw, we got Brandon Williams. Midfielders, I plan to bring in Nogolo Kante because we meant to bring him in this transfer room. The transfer room that just, just shut two weeks ago, but we didn't brought him in. But I'm planning to bring him in anyway for the transfer window. And also the wings. I'd, I hope he's still at the club. I don't know. I'm planning to change. The position of Angel Gomez from the cam into a winger, into a left winger, to be a perfect replacement for Rashford. If you guys remember, every time I use Angel Gomez, what happens? He scores for me. If I'm correct, if I change this position into a left winger, that'd be a good news for me, because then my team could win. To be a perfect replacement for Marcus Rashford, but I need one more winger for left wing. Right wing, because I'm going to see if it works when I get the game. But if Anderson Cavani ain't in the game because his contract expired after PSG last season when he left PSG on a free, as a free agent when his contract expires, if he's not in the game, I want you guys put a poll. I want to. I want you guys to make a comment below. The players I'm really want to bring in, if I have to, I say number seven. Even Charles Felix. Hopefully, it's gonna be be a big signing. Killian Mbappe. Or, hmm, Cristiano. Ronaldo. Those three, I want you guys to vote 
as well. And if you want to uh, name some players you want to bring in, in that for that position, yes. Right wing, I don't know yet. You guys could put that in. And striker, we got Anthony Martial, we got Odin and Gallo. Odin's on his another, have his extended loan to us from one of the teams from Chinese Super League. But if you guys want to put a comment below for that, for a striker as well, I'm happy. Which player you think that I should bring in? Centre backs, I'm planning to bring in about two more. One of them I already plan to bring in is Raphael Foran. That's the one centre back, because I think with Luke Shaw, Harry Maguire, and Raphael Foran, and now Juan Belasco, It'd be a perfect back four. They're all young, they're all talented. I will use Victor Lindelof some games, but not all the time. Same thing, if you guys thought Ronaldo, I will do the same thing. He won't be playing all the time. He's going to be on a crucial contract. It's being as important, but I won't be playing him all the time. Because he's older, he's, he's over his, I think he's about... His, 30, over, I know he's over his 30s, I think about 34, 35 years old, I don't know. And I want you guys to make, ask me, put a comment below, which another centre back I should bring in as well. Alright? This is, and um, also before I forget, before I ask you guys to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell, this Sunday... I will be in, I will, hoping I could do a live on this, on my tablet. This Sunday is hell in a cell. We already got four matches being confirmed. We want to know about the, what type of match Roman and Jay are also going to be in it. Going to be in it. It's be hell in a cell, I quit match. If you guys want, don't know what I quit match, I will let you know. I will tell you on Sunday. Drew McIntyre versus Randy Orton in a Hell in a Cell match. Becky. Not, not, not Becky. I'm oh, sorry. Bailey, the Smackdown Women's Champion, versus Sasha Banks in a Hell in a Cell match. That's three championships on the line of those three Hell in a Cell matches. And the last match is Jeff Hardy versus Elias. Right guys, this is Sonic Freak. Can you guys like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell.